A Franklin boutique vandalized just hours before its grand opening. But as News Channel 5's Sina Sleem shows us, friends and strangers came together in a big way. With less than six hours until Jay Lee's boutique's grand opening Saturday, the Franklin store looked like this. It just felt like my world crashed down. Surveillance video shows a man spray painting the store's front door, windows, sign, and a car parked outside the shop. I can't even explain to you how hard it was to like just process that somebody could be so evil to do that. Owner Joanna Corbin worked tirelessly for weeks to prepare for her launch party. She tells me she refused to let this ruin it. So she got to work, posting on Facebook about the incident, hoping to find someone who could quickly remove the spray paint. But what she got was more than she expected. Volunteers, including strangers, came together to help the owner out so she would be ready for her grand opening. My friends, um, they saw it on Facebook. They dropped everything somewhere at work, came, you know, strangers came and it was all cleaned by 2 p.m. the grand opening. They were able to pull it off. That did not stop my day from being absolutely amazing. Proving to Corbin that good can triumph over evil. In Franklin, Cena Sleem, News Channel 5. Thanks, Cena. Police haven't made an arrest yet, but Corbin says she filed a report and recognizes the man in the video. She hopes officers will make an arrest soon.